It's always felt like home. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me, this enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. Yes. That's got the magic. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. Cool. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Of course, you can give you a word if you're so inclined. Well, you'd be using it on clothing, to be precise, Sebastian. You know it won't work on humans. Accurate. I guess I can't use it on him. Rebellion. Did I reveal something? That lock is all I revealed. The chest, nothing else really. All right, we'll talk to this guy. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. I'm playing the game and you are it. That's what's up. First class student. So we're gonna be going for the platinum here. Alright, where's my next class? Hello there. She's trying student, to talk to me. You? Yeah, what's up? Hello, you wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day's going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. Buy the game for yourself. Let's see. I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. It's probably a combination of both. All right, I'm going back down. Time to learn Avada Kedavra. Actually, what lesson is being taught here? Cool, side quest, I don't care. Ah, Leviosa. I'll show Hermione how it's done. Down? Jesus. There we go. Well, now that I got Accio, I think I can pull those pages toward me. 
I just need to see them. Oh, we're already here. Alright, let's go here. You'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. Wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. All right, let's see, Levioso. Up, up, left, curved, curved, made it easy. Levioso. something a little larger. Let us begin with the basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprise must be well done. Easy. Very good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelists, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso. Basic cast and Protego. You may begin. Boy, if you don't. Let me this cast is your spell. Let's just say I do this job in life. Let me do this job in life. What's up, man? Get knocked out. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. Can you get anything? You give nothing. I put you on the spot and you rose to the challenge. Points to Gryffindor. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again. Well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Revelio. Nice work. He wants to talk to me. What am I revealing here? Just a lock, it looks like. Okay. What's up? I enjoyed that. 
Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Salo, by the way. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Um, I fought. I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Damn. Fair Never enough. Mind. <laughs> you owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Damn, Fight Club. I'll do Exclusive it. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Till next time. He's sucked at dueling and he's like acting like he's so good. Level three, that's what's up. Okay, we're done there. Let's go now. Weasley after class, crossed one. Alright, let's go do this uh, fight club stuff. Keep an eye out for floating pieces of paper. Upstairs, it looks like. This way. Turn through the door. There's a whole bridge here. What the? Oh. Whoa. We're flying by? Yeah, there they go. Alright, let's see here. Gear. Do I have anything cool? Nope. Alright. I was just wondering. Hello. Rebellion. Whee! Oh, no. Haunted toilets. Alice in Dark Straits. It's probably best to avoid this particular toilet as it is allegedly one of Peeves' favorite pranking spots. Here oh, I come from the is. toilet bowl, where you certainly can slip in the deep bowl. As long as we're only one time per week, I can plunge the boy's lavatory. Okay, not he's freaking. Dude's annoying as hell. Oh, I would leave this school if that guy was actually there. Oh my god. Rebellion. Oh, there's a little chest here. Look at that. 47 coins. What's up? Put through here. New flu flame. Lewis. Lewis. I'm not sure what to do there. All right, tell me about Fight Club. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones, a dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I, I kicked his ass. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does cross wands work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. 
Interested? I'm interested. Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Cross Ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Let's do it. Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! Alright. Two. We'll make you regret signing up. Oh yeah, I forgot I'm here with Sebastian. Okay. Break through yellow shields with a Vioso, target with the track enemies. Alright, I got this. Oh shit. Oh god. Defeated? Hell no. We're doing this again. I'm not taking it. Can't you try another round? Yes. Yeah. Don't count me out yet. Brilliant. I thought it would be easier. There we go. Much easier that time. I just have to get my bearings. Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Hope to see you back here again. Alright, did that. Oh shit. Back up. Crossed Ones, round one. Cool. Oh, we got a sorcerer hat. Oh, hell yeah. What's up? Where's my gear? Where the hell is my gear? Headwear. I need to be level four. Is that what you're telling me? Wow. Yep, I gotta be level four to wear that hat. That is such bull. I thought that was gonna be cool. Let's see. We got Weasley after class. Let's do that. Rebellion. Where's his chest at? Through here. I'm guessing it's probably at the end of the quest. Clockwork Fedora. Oh great, I can be a freaking neckbeard. Let's check it out in the gear. New headwear. Can't wear that one either. It's also a level four. Perfect. All right, continue the main quest. That's what we're here for. I'm sure later on we'll be fast traveling everywhere, but for now, let's actually explore this school. Oh my God, that stupid guy. I'm getting out of here. Nope. Let's see downstairs. Or 
across. Now, before I was seeing these freaking pages flying everywhere, and I don't, I see jack shit. There's nothing here. That's right, spin the globe. Don't you dare point your wand at me. You're lucky I don't know about a cadaver yet. I'll kill all of you. Revelio. More locks. Oh shit. Follow the compass. The gun. I guess so. Uh, literally after this, I haven't seen a single page floating around. Oh my god. Adventure, are we? Who's talking? Okay, I don't know where that came from, but uh, let's continue the main quest. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. <coughs> I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professor Spirit and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? I can't say anything. Uh, I'm no snitch. Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a stream. Regardless, what? you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Uh, yeah, they mentioned that. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Okay, one more can you tell me. Can you tell me more about the potions shop, Professor? J. Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Professor Sharp asked that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. Right, spellcraft. I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. And Ollivanders. There's an Ollivanders in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. I'll go with Natty. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, 
the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. There we go, that quest is done. What's this now? Professor Ronin, assignment Reparo. Okay, now we're off. Speak to Professor Ronin to receive first assignment. Assignments are a type of quest given to you by Hogwarts professors that, when completed, reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the Mending Charm Reparo, which is required to complete other quests. You can track assignments and their progress in the quest menu of your field guide. Sounds good to me. How nice to see you, my young friend. Who is talking? Oh, it's her. I'm, I'm done. All right, on we go. Ah, there you are. There he is. But we'll have to wait for next time, because that's all we'll be doing for today. Next time we'll learn a new spell and continue on the main story. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.